Hey everyone, okay, today I'm gonna to be doing a review for you. This is an absolutely amazing product. I'm so pleased I got it. It's called Magnetic Lash. And something like this would be kind of one of those products that I would think, yeah, right. And think that it didn't work and it was gonna be awful, but it really works. It's really quite amazing. It's probably one of the best mascaras I've ever used. It comes with two products. You get the mascara, which looks like this. You then get something called the Lash Builder. This you apply basically from the middle to the ends, but you can apply it to the root, but it's better to leave it kind of from the middle part of the lash on and to the tip of the lash. And it lays down these tiny fibers. You then wait for it to dry and go over with another coat. You can keep building. It's amazing. It gives you long lashes, really long, beautifully kind of fanned out lashes. I have tried using this with just another mascara and it did not work nearly as well so there you go the two of these together cost 25 pounds so it's a high-end product but it really is worth it i'm actually going to just demonstrate it for you rather than just keep talking because mascara is one of those things that if mascara is the most bought cosmetic and this is a wonderful product so let me zoom into my 12 year old eye and we'll show you what it looks like so i've just curled my lashes and you can see that this is the non-curled side i don't have long lashes I don't have thick lashes. They're sort of medium length and they're nothing special. So what I'm gonna do is just do a coat of mascara and I'm going to just apply it in small layers because I'd rather build up slowly. I'm just gonna make sure there's not too much on the end because I wanna come in to the inner corner And you can see that it doesn't, it fans out the lash, which is just amazing. And they look quite lovely um, as they are. What I'm gonna do is take the lash builder and on the middle to the ends, I'm going to apply them. Making sure that I'm going from the middle lengths up you can see I'm fanning them out with the tip. And now I'm just going to wait for it to dry slightly. Then I'm going to do another layer of, found, uh, of mascara and then another layer of these. Okay, so I'm just going to put through another coat of mascara. Just combing it through. and just comb it through. And then I'm gonna add one last set of fibers. And I'm hoping that you can really see this kind of feathered out look that it's done to the lashes. It's, re it's thickened them, it's given them more length, and it's just one of the most, you know, beautiful mascaras that I've used because it really does add that kind of starburst feathery effect to the lashes. I'm really hoping that the camera is doing it justice because when I'm looking in the mirror here, they just look so open and sparse. What I wouldn't recommend is using the lash builder on the lower lash line, just use a coat of mascara under and, you know, but you can build up, you can put like three or four coats on and get the most fanned out lashes you, you like. And what's good is if you've got sort of lashes like mine, which aren't amazing, it really does open up and give the effect of lots more lashes. It's one of hands down the best mascaras I've ever used. This is not a sponsor video. I'm not being paid. These are mine. And I just think it's absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.